Hey everyone, Edwards here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you what to do if the Windows 11 VPN is not working. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to update Windows 11. To do this press the Windows button then select the settings icon and then on the left pane make sure to scroll down until you find and select the Windows Update category. In here on the right side just click on the blue check for updates button and then wait until Windows will try to find the best possible updates for your PC. Afterwards install the updates and then restart your PC and then check if the problem still persists. Another useful solution is to reinstall the WAN mini port network adapters. To do this right click the Windows button then select Device Manager from the list of options. In the Device Manager window just make sure to expand Network Adapters. And afterwards just right click one mini port IP and then select the Uninstall Device option. Now just confirm by pressing on Uninstall and then once you restart your PC Windows will automatically reinstall the driver for the WAN mini port. You can also flush the DNS. To do this press the Windows button then simply type CMD and then run command prompt as an administrator. In here just copy paste the following commands from the description below but press enter after each command. Afterwards just restart your PC and then you can check if the problem still persists. Another useful solution is to disable the Internet Protocol version 6. To do this press the Windows button then simply type view network connections and select it from the search results. In here just right click your VPN network adapter and select the properties option. Afterwards scroll down until you find the Internet Protocol version 6 and then simply uncheck the box next to it. Now press on OK and save the changes. You can now check if the problem still persists. Another useful solution is to disable the proxy settings. To do this press the Windows button then select the settings icon and afterwards make sure to click on Network and Internet on the left pane and then on the right side scroll down until you find the proxy section and simply select it. In here, under the manual proxy setup, if use a proxy server is set to on, just click on the setup button. Now in the edit proxy server window, make sure that the toggle to use a proxy server is set to off. Now just click on save and then check if the problem still persists. Another great solution is to set up an exception for UDP. To do this, press the Windows button, then simply type regedit and select registry editor from the search results. In here, navigate to the following location. H key local machine, then double click system, afterwards double click current control set, then expand services, and afterwards scroll way down until you find the policy agent key. In here on the right side just right click an empty space, then hover over new and select D word. Now the name of the D word should be assume UDP encapsulation context on send rule. So name it like this. Now just double click this D word and make sure that in the value data to input 2 as a value. Now press on OK to save the changes. Afterwards just restart your PC and check if the problem still persists. And lastly another great solution is to reinstall your VPN software. To do this just press the Windows button then type in appwiz.cpl and simply select it from the search results. Now in here just find the VPN software that you have installed on your PC, click it and then simply click on the uninstall or change button. Afterwards restart Windows and then simply try to reinstall the software. And that's it, plenty of solutions to consider. As usual, for more information and details, you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video, just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.